All right, welcome to this lesson on the best small business checking accounts for high ticket dropshipping. So you're gonna need a checking account for your business and this is gonna be where you receive your funds and where you're gonna pay your credit cards and other expenses. Uh, this article is on transferwise.com blog and TransferWise is kind of cool. It's, uh, it works really well for international sellers, but people all over the world can use it. They have what's called a borderless checking account, and uh, basically they provide you with a checking account and routing number in any country you need, so that uh, no matter where you're making an income from, you can actually have it routed through this account back to your home country and pay very little fees on it. So if you are international, this is the best solution for you. TransferWise, I highly recommend it. You can click the link in the description and get a fee-free transfer, I believe on your first 500 dollars or so. Um, so go ahead and do that. It's ecommerceparadise.com slash transferwise to get that. But with that said, if you are in the States, then you will need a business checking account in the States. And they list some really good ones here. Number one, I actually use them. It's Chase. They have a total business checking account. And it's uh, no fees if you carry over a certain amount of balance or you process a certain amount of transactions and stuff like that. So just read through their stuff. Um, if you don't have a 1500 minimum deposit, uh, you'll pay $12, $16 monthly fee. It's not that much. But yeah, they are very cool about stuff. Um, they won't open an account though if your business is in Wyoming. So if your business is in Wyoming, uh, you'll have to use Bank of America or TransferWise or Wells Fargo. And I think US Bank might even work too. Uh, Bank of America is okay though. I've had I've heard some complaints about them, uh, specifically on their online business. So it's up to you. Um, tread wisely. Tread carefully. Um, yeah, TransferWise is great, especially if you are international. I already explained that. I haven't used this one myself. TV Business Convenience Checking Plus. You could look into it. Um, I have used US Bank in the past for personal. I've never used them for business checking, but they are a good bank. And uh, yeah, they've always done me well, so I could recommend them as a bank. Wells Fargo is great. I use them also for other accounts. And uh, yeah, they do provide really simple business checking. I'm glad that they call it simple business checking because it's easy to figure out. And yeah, so those are my highly recommended ones. And um, yeah, links in the description are below. Uh, you'll need one of these accounts. You won't be able to sign up for one until you get your business formed, your LLC or sole prop, and you get your EIN and DBA if you're a sole prop. Um, but once you do, you can form your business checking account and you'll need that to get your business started. So go ahead and get started with that, make your choice, talk to a banker, um, ask them more questions. And uh, yeah, if they try to pitch you on a credit card after you sign up for your checking account, hold off and uh, wait till you see my recommended credit card in the next lesson uh, coming soon. And uh, yeah, you also need a business credit card. So I'll see you guys in the next lesson.